Hi Taurus, I hope you're doing well. So we'll be looking at whoever you're thinking about here for the rest of the year. Will they feel that if they were to come towards you, there may have been an ending here? You may have ended the situation and because of secrets here. You didn't trust this person, High Priestess, but I'm getting it may have been you that ended, it, ended the situation because you're coming through as a fool. Right? After ending something, it's a new chapter. But this person isn't coming towards you because they feel there will be conflict between the both of you, perhaps not seeing eye to eye. That is the reason they are holding back. Why strength in reverse? Ten of swords, yeah. They're not fighting this ending. But very anxious. This person is still holding on to you, Taurus. I don't think they're done with you. They think about this. This, this situation caused them a lot of anxiety. They feel frustrated. And they're still hopeful. Because we have Eight of Swords in their outcome, which is which is why I'm thinking that is their energy. But they're feeling a bit weak right now. They're, they're not feeling good. They're not feeling confident. Why strength in reverse here? It's a bit of a, yeah, Eight of Swords. It's a low period for them. They feel they don't have the energy, the confidence here. So it's someone who is taking a step back to almost recharge their batteries, perhaps. A lot of overanalyzing this situation. But they are, they're feeling weak right now, which is why they're not doing anything. Your stance, we have the Fool upright, Nine of Wands in reverse. Some of you gave up, right? You don't want to fight for this. They're coming through as the Nine of Wands upright. You're coming through as the Nine of Wands in reverse. And some of you may be ready for the new. You don't want baggage. You're sort of light-hearted and free in your approach. Why is the fool here? For Taurus energy. Now, yeah, look at that. So <laughs> your focus is you. I've been getting that for Taurus quite a bit. Yeah, you're self-reliant, you're independent, you don't need anyone. You're enjoying your own company and you're having the time of your life. Why is Nine of Wands in reverse here? Yeah, which is why I was getting you don't want anything that will bring you down because you're in a good space here. Why is Nine of Wands in reverse here for Taurus stance? Ooh, Page of Pentacles, yeah. I mean, there's memories here. Six of Cups, some of you children involved. Yeah, hanging man, death. Perhaps you did wait on this person in the past when you were waiting on in the past, but you're no longer. Yeah, you're not offering them anything. Seriously, your energy is pretty straightforward to me. Your focus is you and you're emotionally independent, not reliant on the situation. You don't look to this person to fulfill anything within you, right? You're vibrating high, you feel, you feel emotionally fulfilled with what you have going for you outside of this connection. So yeah, your life is not dependent on this person or situation. How they're feeling about you while well, they're losing their patience with hanged man in reverse and knight of swords. This person is impulsive. They have something they're wanting to say to you. They're losing patience is what I'm getting. Why is hanged man in reverse here? So maybe this person was acting single independent. There was no communication. Oh, one more on the hanged man. Yeah, I was getting that. What is this person planning? They're strategizing. They're planning. They're planning on what to say to you. Mercury is coming through strong communication. This person wants to speak to you. And they may take impulsive action towards you. Clarify the Knight of Swords. Clarify the Knight of Swords. They want to send you a message. Is how they're feeling. Why is Knight of Swords here?
that there's something that has been weighing heavy on this person's mind and they're losing patience. Perhaps they were patiently waiting, reflecting, but they're wanting to come towards you. It's not the most romantic emotional communication. Clarify the Ace of Cups in reverse. This person's confused. They need clarity in regards to some situation. They have something to say about a home, children, some sort of living situation. Because in their feelings, this was someone who's taking a break. They were thinking about what they want to say to you and they want to charge towards you. They have something on their mind that they weren't expressing and they want to express this to you. That is what I'm getting. Holding this person was doing their best to restrain themselves and it's almost, it's a breaking point, which I had. Oh, let me get your oracle cards I had for you because it's tying in. Well, we have amazing chemistry here. I'll get to this card here in a second. Boiling point. Yeah, this person can't hold it in anymore. Kept selfies. That's straightforward. Can be looking at your pictures, missing you. We did have the six, six of cups. How they'll act towards you, we have Queen of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles in reverse, someone who's really unstable. Some of you, they are struggling financially. Why is Queen of Pentacles in reverse here? So a lot of issues this person has. Yeah, they're confused. They don't know what to do, which is why they're not coming in. They're in a low period, it's low vibrational energy. This is harsh. Five of Wands, Ten of Swords, Eight of Swords, Five of Cups, Death. Some of you, they can be mourning a loss of something else in there. More so I'm getting it's about you. They're sad and they don't know what to do. What their intentions are, we have Four of Pentacles, Seven of Pentacles. They're having a hard time letting this go. They're still wanting to invest. They feel they did put a lot of time and energy into this. And others of you, I'm getting someone who's concerned about their stability, their finances. They may be saving. It's a bit paranoid. Why is Four of Pentacles here? Why is Four of Pentacles here for the person on Taurus mind? Intentions. Why is Four of Pentacles here? It's almost a fear of the unknown, which is why this is someone who clings to their... Yeah, it's almost they've created a safe place for themselves. But now they're having a hard time. They're resistant to change. Some of you, this person is just stubborn, right? Very fixed in their ways. Why is Seven of Pentacles here? Yeah, they still want... Okay, this is someone who's missing you because I said they maybe have lost someone else. Do you see how they're focused on the three cups that have spilled? We have the three cups here. This person misses your friendship, your company, your support. Perhaps you did give them a lot of emotional support or even financial here. Some of you, there's no communication. Ace of Swords in reverse, and you're happily single with the Fool and Nine of Cups. At least you're acting quite independent here in your energy. Clarify the Seven of Pentacles for this person's intentions. They don't want to let go of this. They feel very safe, comfortable. Yeah, the, the being in one's comfort zone and not wanting to explore new. But your energy is the opposite. You're wanting new. This person's holding on to what was. They want reconciliation. And they're possessive over you, this connection. But they also have trust issues, so there's a lot going on. A lot of internal struggles. How this person is viewing you. Very nervous. 
Emperor Six of Wands. Yeah, this person's really attracted to you. Amazing chemistry. Yeah. Uh, Empress and Six of Wands. This person puts you on a pedestal. They think you're very beautiful, handsome, attractive. Someone who gets a lot of attention. Someone who's very successful. Wise Hermit in reverse here. Why is this person viewing Taurus? Well, if you have been isolated, they feel that you want to come back around to them. That you also want this reconciliation that you still want to give to the situation. That is how they're viewing you. So this person may be assuming that you want to, you don't want to be apart from them because I'm getting there's, they're confused. So they're not sure. Right? They go back and forth because a lot of you I see there is lack of communication or no communication or perhaps bad communication. I'm not sure. They're assuming this about you. I don't think this person knows. Sometimes they feel that you've moved on and you're getting attention from others. You may be giving to someone else and then other, other times they feel that you're wanting to come back around to them and give uh, to the situation for your outcome we have three of wands death in reverse queen of wands upright why is why is death in reverse here for taurus outcome well there you are yeah. you're coming through upright I think you have your money on your mind. You may be, some of you may be holding on to some sort of resentment on um, what happened in the past, but we have an Ace of Pentacles. Ooh, we have Three of Wands in reverse twice. This is an odd Ten of Pentacles in reverse, Seven of Pentacles. Some of you may be waiting for this person to act right. I mean, they're coming towards you with the Knight of Swords. Some impulsive move or some... Um, it's haste. It's hasty action. I think some of you may feel emotionally invested or connected um, to the situation to some extent, but I think you have your money. You're some sort of businessman, businesswoman, entrepreneur. And you're feeling quite confident, bold. I don't think, yeah, I was getting that. I don't think your life depends on this, but something about this situation is still lingering. It's stuck. Two sets of you. Some of you are diverting your attention to your finances, your work. You're not planning with this person. Three of Wands in reverse. You don't see potential. And then there's others of you that are waiting here for things to change with the death in reverse. For this person's outcome, we have a Wheel of Fortune in reverse, Nine of Swords, Ten of Cups, High Priestess in reverse, Eight of Swords, very anxious. We have Eight and Nine of Swords, Period of Bad Luck, Victim Mentality, feeling that things aren't going in their favor. This person's stuck in the past. This, this is karma. We have justice clarifying wheel of fortune in reverse. Something, especially if this person did you wrong. Yeah, things aren't going in their favor here. Some of you, this may have been a divorce. But something in their life is not going the way they want and they feel things are not fair. That they always get the short end of the stick. Why is the King of Swords here? This may have been a divorce. I'm getting a lawyer, some sort of legal situation. Why is King of Swords here? Whoa. Perhaps this person was, had some toxic ways. There's some co 
codependency obsession this person is codependent i'm getting when it comes to you yeah perhaps there was some lying cheating sneaky behavior in the past you cut this person out and now they're obsessing about you amazing chemistry kept selfies you may not be communicating and they want to come back around to you because they're losing patience with the boiling point but they have trust issues wow i'm obsessed with you it's a lot of anxiety i want to experience new things with you and we have, are you impressed with the things I have in me? That's how some of you may have felt that this person's in, because you're coming through as the king of pentacles. So someone may have tried to take advantage of your finances, your resources in some way, but that will be for very few of you. Someone may have thought the other was with them for what they have, what they own. Careless, I didn't see your worth until it was too late. You didn't deserve that. Would you forgive me? Five of Cups. Regret. Okay, hurt. I need some inner child healing before I can cultivate any kind of relationship, circumstances, pessimism, fear, all that. Circumstances, Wheel of Fortune in Reverse. There was a series of unfortunate events in my life. I had to disconnect from the world. It wasn't just you. Yeah, they are going through a rough period here. Dating you is like being in a maze. I'm trying to find clever ways to win you over. <laughs> that reminds me of the magician because I was telling you this person's taking a step back to plan, strategize of what they want to say to you but we also have i was mentioning they're losing patience i've lost my patience it's time that i move on perhaps you were on a break from this person they're very impatient i see that with strength in reverse and then hanged man in reverse and knight of swords it's a restless impatient impulsive energy I'll continue to play your silly games. It's quite endearing. So they may think you're playing games with them. Some of them, if you've had an argument, they feel that you're just playing games and you'll be back. Wants and needs. I take stock of my relationships and I'm honest about what I want and need from the people in my life. I note the difference between the two. Wants are negotiable, needs are not. Both may be desired and either may be acquired. But that's getting into Venn diagram territory and no one wants to draw one of those. Chris, that is what I have for you. Hopefully this offered you some clarity. If you would like to book a personal reading, the info will be in the description box below. Otherwise, take care of yourself and I'll see you next week. Bye.